Hi, my name is Eric Marr, and I'm running for the San Francisco Board of Supervisors in District 1, the Richmond District. While I respect the contribution other candidates are making to an informed debate, I believe I am the most qualified to represent the Richmond District on the Board of Supervisors, and would like to take a few minutes to explain why. My candidacy is an extension of my 24-year history of advocacy and leadership for working families, youth and seniors, small businesses, and the diverse residents of the Richmond District and San Francisco. As you may know, I've served as an elected commissioner on the San Francisco Board of Education for the past eight years. During this period, I've led efforts to clean up corruption, restore physical accountability, close the achievement gap, and secure new funding streams for teacher salaries, libraries and arts, sports and enrichment programs. I've also championed green schoolyards, safe and healthy learning environments, and multicultural education. As a result, I am proud to say that San Francisco's schools have been the state's highest performing urban school district for the past six years. Beyond my work on the Board of Education, I have been a teacher at San Francisco State University in the School of Ethnic Studies for 16 years. As a public interest attorney, I've served on the Human Rights Committee of the State Bar of California. As a community advocate, I've been a leader in the fight for district elections and good government reforms in our city. And I've served as director of the Coalition for Immigrant Rights. My roots are deep in the Richmond. My wife, Sandy, is a public school teacher, and my daughter, Jade, is a third grader at McCoppin School on 6th Avenue and Anza. For over two decades, I have been a strong community advocate supporting our neighborhood youth centers, small businesses, employment training and mental health centers, child care, preschool and after school programs, and transportation, environmental and affordable housing groups. I'm running for supervisor to improve our quality of life in the Richmond District and throughout San Francisco. I'll bring experienced and thoughtful leadership to City Hall to overcome political divisions that stand in the way of San Francisco tackling critical challenges to keep working families in San Francisco, improve Muni and our transportation system, address homelessness and the lack of affordable housing, and restore public safety. I am proud to have received the sole endorsement of the broadest and most extensive range of organizations and leaders of any candidate in the District 1 race. I have been sole endorsed by the San Francisco Democratic Party and our own Richmond District Democratic Club as well as organizations like the United Educators of San Francisco, the Sierra Club, California Nurses Association, the San Francisco Labor Council, Coleman Advocates for Children and Youth Action Fund, United Healthcare Workers, the League of Young Voters, San Francisco for Democracy, and many other important and diverse organizations. Political leaders such as Senators Leland Yee and Carol Migdon, Assemblywoman Fiona Ma, Public Defender Jeff Adachi, former Mayor Art Agnos, and a majority of the Board of Supervisors and Board of Education all believe I am the most qualified candidate to represent the Richmond District. And I'm honored to have the support of respected community leaders, Dennis and Henny Kelly, Jesse Fink of Toy Boat Cafe, Jane Morrison, Sandy Lee Fewer, Henry Durr, Emile de Guzman, Michael Bornstein, Reverend Calvin Wong, Richard and Shirley Hansen, Harrison Lim, Dr. Ling Chi Wong, and Shirley Breyer Black, to name a few. Finally, as I reach out to voters through my grassroots volunteer-based campaign, I pledge to meet the highest ethical and clean campaigning standards and practices. As a longtime advocate for election reform and good government practices, I understand how negative and dirty campaigning harms our democracy. Voters are turned off by misleading campaign hit pieces and negative campaigning voter turnout declines, and our democracy suffers. I am committed to running a clean, positive campaign and have invited other candidates to do the same so that voters, whomever they support, will elect a supervisor on the basis of facts, the candidate's record, and what is best for each voter's best interest, not on fear or scare tactics. Thank you for listening and for your thoughtful consideration. I would appreciate your vote on November 4th. I also welcome your input and involvement in my campaign. For more information, please visit our website at ericmar.com or call us at 415-422-0360. Thank you again.
SF Votes. The League of Women Voters has joined with your public, educational, and government cable stations to provide the election information you need. SF Votes. Meet the candidates, learn about the city's ballot measures, and find out how you can make your voice heard. SF Votes. Grassroots. Independent. Complete election coverage you can find nowhere else. Brought to you by the League of Women Voters, Access SF, EA TV, and SFGTV.